this meeting of the Sacramento Public Library Authority to order on January 27th, 2022 at 3.02 p.m. If the clerk could please call the roll to establish a quorum. Angelique Ashby. Here. Bobby Singh Allen. Here. Don Natoli. Okay, all righty. Well, Eric Guerra. Here. Garrett. Here. Kevin Spees. Present. My Vang. Patrick Kennedy. Bill Cerna. Here. Rich Desmond. Rick James. I'm here. Sean Lalowy. Here. Sean um, oh, here. Sean Farmer. Sue Frost. Here. Tim Schaefer. Here. Linda Budge. Darren Soon. Jeff Harris. Saul Hernandez. Here. Joshua Hoover. Uh, Steve Miller or Brett Dent. Uh, Steve Miller. Karina Talamantes, Chinua Rhodes, and we have 15 members present, and I'll read the statement. This meeting of the Sacramento Public Library Authority is cablecast live on Metro Cable 14. Uh, Madam Clerk, you're on mute. Do you mind starting reading the statement again? Did it just start with the statement? Yes. Okay. This meeting of the Sacramento Public Library Authority is cablecast live on Metro Cable 14, the local government affairs channel on the Comcast Consolidated Communications and AT&T UVerse cable systems. This meeting is closed captioned and live streamed at metro14live.satcounty.net. Today's meeting will be repeated Saturday, January 29 at 4 p.m. on channel 14, and can also be viewed on Metro Cable 14's YouTube channel. The meeting will also be recorded via Zoom. A DVD copy will be available upon request no later than two weeks following today's meeting. The full agenda, including reports, is available on the library website at www.saclibrary.org. Members of the audience wishing to address the board should raise their hand in the Zoom program. Please speak clearly when addressing the board and state your name for the record. Comments are limited to three minutes so that everyone may be heard. Please also note that participation in this teleconference via telephone rather than the Zoom app may result in your telephone number being visible to the public during the live broadcast and later telecasts of this meeting. Thank you very much, Madam Clerk. If folks could please help us uh, rise with me to uh, join me in the Pledge of Allegiance. Salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, everyone. Adam Clerk, uh, let's go on to our next item. Item two, public comments on matters not on the agenda. Madam Clerk, do we have any members of the public signed up to speak? No, we don't. Thank you. Madam Clerk, if you can go on to the next item on the agenda. Item three, presentation. Friends of the Sacramento Public Library, uh, good afternoon. Uh, uh, is it immediate past president Karen Wilson? Hey, I'm president for nine more days. But for nine more days. Okay, <laughs> great. <laughs> well, fantastic. Well, President Wilson, uh, uh, please report. Well, thank you very much. Good afternoon. Uh, first, I'd like to extend a big welcome to our new library director, Peter Coyle, on behalf of the Friends of the Sacramento Public Library. We're looking forward to working with him in all of our libraries this year. Uh, the Friends have been busy working with library staff to get ready for to get ready some classroom packets of books and make virtual classroom visits for book first, year six. Uh, the library's on track to deliver 14,000 books to first graders in 180 schools throughout Sacramento. 
uh, learning loss from COVID related interruptions is real and support for young readers is needed this year more than ever. We're happy to be there. And the Book Den is still accepting donations and holding warehouse sales with COVID protocols. We're donating books to dozens of local community organizations. And I had the privilege of handing out COVID test kits with staff at South Thomas Library earlier this month. And I would just like for you to know that staff is completely dedicated to that effort. They went all out. And that's really what it took to get that many test kits out. I'm happy to report that we've re exceeded our fundraising goal for the Young Readers Fund, honoring Rivka and helping young readers into the future. So thank you for joining our honorary committee and for your generous donations. And we look forward to having you join us for a short, fun Zoom event tomorrow to toast Rivka, welcome Peter, celebrate the Young Readers Fund. Your invitations are in your email. This is my last time before you, as Chair Guerra said, as president of the Friends of the Sacramento Public Library. Our incoming president is Fred Dopp, and he's on the Zoom with us today. Hi, Fred. So thank you for your support of the library. It's been a very, very pleasant couple of years getting to come before you even virtually. I think I, I got to come before you in person one time before everything shut down. But thank, thank you. Great, thank you very much, Karen. We appreciate all your work and the volunteerism at the Friends of the Library. We had a chance to say hello to some of our friends in a couple of our libraries uh, this week over at the Fruit Ridge and Elk Grove Library. And we appreciate the friends out there in, uh, in South County. Okay, Madam Clerk, uh, let's uh, move on to our next item. Item four, executive team report. Well, welcome Peter Coyle to your first meeting and your first executive team report. Uh, glad to have you here and uh, take it away. Uh, thank you, Mr. Chairman and members of, of the board. Um, we have our written report in the packet. I won't, um, I won't belabor that um, other than to note that uh, we did a whirlwind tour of all of our locations, uh, met with a number of staff and had a, a really great uh, chance to, to interact with lots of our friends um, to begin our, our, our sojourn through the, the city and the county. And um, uh, the second day on the job, we also observed the staff distributing COVID test kits. It was quite the, uh, quite the sight to see the, the demand from the public for that important uh, resource. Um, so I'll answer any questions if you have any, um, but if, if not, I will just uh, say there are two things. Uh, one, our statistic report, there is a, an error in it. So next, next month we'll be re uh, issuing that there was a, a, a calculation error done. Um, and if there are no questions for me, I'll, I'll give a couple of minutes to, to Jared, who has an item uh, that he needs to address. Yes, hi, just a quick update. Um, at the December Authority Board meeting, Group 4 Planning and Architecture provided an update on the status of our facilities master plan. And we would like your help. And tomorrow, um, Heather will be sending out an email that has a couple different dates and times. And we'd like to get your feedback on the on what do you think the future of our facilities need to be? So please be on the lookout for that email. And if you can, please attend one of the sessions so you can meet with us in Group 4. So thank you, everyone. Thank you, Jared. Thank you, Peter. Uh, let me bring it back to the board. Any questions from the board uh, for our executive team? Let's see. Yes, uh, Mayor Singh Allen. I just wanted to state that it was a pleasure meeting you, Peter, in person and taking you on a tour of some of our libraries out here in Elk Grove. And then, of course, I'm joining Chair Aragueta for our little interview by, um, by Chairman Guetta. That was fun, but uh, we just we're here as a city to help you in any way that we can, and as particularly as we open up our new library. So welcome aboard. Great, thank you, Mayor Singh Allen. Really appreciate that, and really appreciate the warm welcome I've received from from you and and everyone else that I've I've been able to meet with. It really has been um, a great start to this, and I'm I'm really happy to be here. So thank you. Great, thank you. Okay, uh, no other questions. I see no hands raised. Uh, then uh, Madam Clerk, we'll go on to the next item here. Item five, information. Thank you, Madam Clerk. Everyone has the uh, packets of the uh, uh, regular reports on our financial, treasure, and uh, annual reports. If there's no, are there any questions from staff for on these reports? Uh, 
Okay, then on the information item, uh, Madam Clerk, we'll go on to our action items here. Next, uh, next item, Madam Clerk. Item six, consent. Okay, um, uh, on this item, let me ask uh, Madam Clerk, are there members of the public signed up to speak? No, there are not. Let me, uh, let me bring it back to the board then. Any actions from the board? I'll ask for a motion to approve the consent item. Anybody want to take a risk on that one? So moved. Natoli would move. All right, moved by uh, board member Natoli, seconded by uh, uh, Vice Chair Gatewood here. Uh, any other debate? Seeing none, Madam Clerk, if you could please call the roll. Angelique Ashby. Yes. Bobby Singh Allen. Yes. Don Natoli. Aye. Eric Guetta. Aye. Garrett Gatewood. Aye. Kevin Spees. Aye. Mai Vang. Yes. Patrick Kennedy. Phil Cerna. Aye. Rich Desmond. Rick Jennings. Yes. Sean Lalowy. Aye. Sean Farmer. Sue Frost. Aye. Tim Schaefer. Aye. Saul Hernandez. Aye. And the motion passes with 13 members present. Thank you, Madam Clerk. Okay, Madam Clerk, we'll move on to the next item. Item 7.1, election of board chair and vice chair for 2022. Well, thank you everyone. Uh, it was a pleasure to serve this, this year as chair. As is customary, we uh, rotate between one of the cities and then a member of the County Board of Supervisors. Uh, we have the list here of, uh, in, of past uh, folks who've served. Um, and uh, I, do, I do wanna thank also our, um, our vice chair, uh, th that has served this year, Director Gatewood. Uh, and uh, um, I'd like to uh, suggest a, a motion uh, that we recommend uh, Director Gatewood as, a, um, uh, as chair for the next cycle. Um, I know um, uh, Supervisor Desmond isn't here, so maybe if there's a pod, that's what happens when you don't show up to a meeting. Maybe we, uh, you get appointed to something. So it would be, a, I, I, looking at the rotations, it seems his, his seat may be up for this. But with that, I'll ask for a motion from the board on this action item. Are we nominating uh, Supervisor Desmond as, as vice chair? Second, Singh Allen. Great, I, I will take board member Lalowy's uh, motion to nominate uh, Garrett Gatewood as chair of the next year, and then uh, 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 Supervisor Desmond as vice chair uh, for the next year. Is that correct, Mr. Lalowy? Uh, yes. I just right. hope that Supervisor Desmond does not use this against me, uh, <laughs> considering I need some assistance from his office. <laughs> so I'm, I'm texting him right now. <laughs> yes, uh, and I heard a good second from Mayor St. Allen. And uh, to be on the safe side, I gave him a heads up before uh, I was, uh, was going to suggest this. So. Well, I'm, I'm congratulating him just to be good. on the safe side. <laughs> I want to tell him that he got the votes, so he's, he's not nervous anymore. Well, good. I, I've heard a nomination and a second here. Uh, any other nominations from the floor? Seeing none, Madam Clerk, can we uh, call the roll on this uh, on this motion? Angelique Ashby? Yes. Bobby Singh Allen? Yes. Don Natoli? Aye. Eric Guetta? Aye. Garrett Gatewood? Aye. Kevin Spees? Aye. Mai Vang? Yes. Patrick Kennedy? Bill Cerna? Aye. Rich Desmond? Rick Jennings? Yes. Sean Lalowy? Aye. Sean Farmer? Sue Frost? Aye. Tim Schaefer? Aye. Saul Hernandez? Aye. And that's unanimous with 13 members present. Well, thank you, Madam Clerk. Congratulations, uh, incoming Chair Gatewood and uh, Mayor of uh, 
uh, or immediate past mayor of uh, Rancho Cordova. Uh, I do want to thank all of the staff and everyone involved in this last year. We went through a pretty extensive search here to, um, to uh, find our new director in that year. Uh, we also uh, accomplished our collective bargaining in that year. Uh, and also, uh, I think accomplished our, uh, which uh, is a little combination of my other hat as chair of the Air District, our three electric mobility, mobile, uh, uh, which we're still uh, moving through, our mobile uh, bookmobiles. Uh, and so uh, a lot happened in 2021, given the pandemic and then our, our challenges. So I do want to thank all of our staff, uh, all of our library staff, uh, for making it a very painless year as chair for the Library Authority. Uh, with that, um, uh, Madam Clerk, uh, our next item. Item eight, reports, ideas, and questions from board members. Let me bring this back to the board. Anyone have any reports, ideas, or questions from the board? Seeing none, uh, thank you, Madam Clerk. Is, uh, that, I believe, is the balance of our agenda. Yes. Great. Well, thank you all. I'd uh, like to uh, uh, thank everyone for, your, for this quick and speedy meeting and making it painless for our new director. I can't guarantee that the next one will be this easy, but uh, welcome aboard. Yeah. Hey, and Chair. Director Eric, thanks for being such a great chair this year. Yeah, really exactly. Yeah, yeah, normally we, yeah, somebody should say thanks to Eric. Tough year, and you ushered in a new leader and ushered out a, a longtime leader. Thanks to you. Chair Gary, you did a great job. That was that's not an easy year to lead, and you and you had a lot on your plate. You did a good job. Thanks for thanks for taking care of the library authority all year. No, yeah, no, great. appreciate good job, Eric. it. Congratulations, yeah. Chair. Yeah, also, that was great. Councilmember Guerra. If, if you could give us the recipe to what what is the secret to, <laughs> to finish a meeting in eighteen minutes, so we can and implement this is that a, our, our city council meeting meetings. Ever. So I'm very excited. Eighteen about minutes. This. If we can, if we can use your recipe for our council meetings, my <laughs> goodness, eighteen minutes, fabulous. So I credit. The supervisors would like that. Bless them, they have day long meetings. <laughs> just, just think of the challenge that that Chair Gatewood is going to have next year i gotta do a meeting in 15 minutes so the I'm good part is, is that's the goal the time to beat is 18 minutes 18 minutes FYI. 18 I, I wrote it down already so <laughs> well, i appreciate you got some big shoes to fill sir <laughs> i will credit uh, the future farmers of america and being part of the parliamentary procedure team so all those have affairs thank you all and uh, uh also have a good one we'll make sure we don't delay this any longer. All right, guys. <laughs> Thank you, Eric. All right, everyone. Have a good Bye. 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 Bye.